What's up guys? So we got a new addition to the channel. It's a 2017 Jeep Wrangler Sahara. She went from her uh, Ford Escape to this. Uh, we just got it last week when it finally arrived. We uh, went to the dealership, got a little paperwork done and stuff and we're in Edmonton over my birthday. It's a really nice Jeep. There's a couple little dings and stuff on it, but they're gonna fix that next time we go to Edmonton. It's got 18 inch rims and 255s I believe, which is a 33 inch tire. I'm like 100% sure. But uh, she's in love with it, and I'm really happy that she got something that she enjoys and likes because that Ford Escape was a pile of junk. And uh, there's a lot of stuff that she wants to do to it, and I'll be filming it all and get it all on video unless she does start her own YouTube channel, which she talked about. So if she does that, I won't do it all. I'll like just show uh, little pieces of it. But yeah, it's a really nice Jeep, and she loves it. What are you driving? Jetty. Do you like it? 2017 Sahara Unlimited? Uh, maybe. <laughs> she doesn't even know what it is. She just knows it's a Wrangler. Watch room for the kids, trunk for the dog. Why does the blinker sound so freaking aggressive? Stupid? No, it's. It's a Jeep thing. It's a lot of good stuff and a lot of stupid stuff. Like, look at these oversized uh, vents. <laughs> so here's some more photos of the jeep that's my two sons they wanted to get a photo with it that was like two days after we got it it has a 3.5 v6 in it um i miss the street sixes obviously i like them there's a lot more working room under the hood as well with those but uh she wants to do a lot of stuff with it she wants to wrap it uh pink and like the whole interior is going to be pink basically she's going to make it hers that's for sure and uh she wants to get better rims and rock sliders bumpers winches lifts and all that so stay tuned for that so some updates for my jeep i took those fender flares off and uh i cut the fenders because the 31s they rubbed on it pretty bad and it was knocking the fender flares basically off anyway so i decided to take them off and uh i think it looks a little better with them off but i do want to get some uh some nice metal ones later on uh we haven't took it out yet i cleaned it off really good i got a little mud and stuff off of it because i'm gonna start working on the sanding the roof down and repainting it and all that stuff because the roof's pretty rusty i wanted to get the window first but i think i'm just gonna go ahead and start the roof just to get it done with because it looks disgusting the hood's the same thing um yeah so here's the pictures of the fenders i cut them just along that little seam there so it has a little lip still there's a lot of room in there but with fender flares uh, when I get them and bigger tires will look nicer once I get a lift and stuff it'll, it'll just look way better I think so uh, anyways yeah I want to get the rockers done my buddy just got a welder so hopefully we can get them welded on he's doing his as well once he gets a little better at welding he hasn't welded for a while so we're gonna get that done um, the roof done and then the back fenders are disgusting looking I peeled the fender flares off and then I took the little metal bracket that holds them on off and uh, they don't look too pleasing at all so these are definitely gonna need some work as you can see they're pretty rusty I was gonna cut and fold them but I might have to cut a little bit more off down Wanu which I don't because where the pinch welds are I don't want to pop those open and get a bunch of dirt going into my trunk because from where the body or the fender the quarter panel meets the the trunk it will like seep in there this side's not as bad but that other side was pretty gross um, yeah, so I'm getting a two inch pucks and two inch uh, shackles for the rear to uh, get a little bit more lift out of it for now until I'm able to get something bigger, which I hope I can get this summer. I want to get at least a 4.5 inch lift if, if I can and get 33s. I, wa I really want to get a six inch lift with uh, 35s, but it gets a little pricey and you need a lot more extra stuff and whatnot. And uh, yeah, I just don't have the money for that right now. And I want to get fender flares on this Jeep. I want to get a roof rack for the spare tire. I have the spare tire. I just need to get a rim for it. And yeah, there'll be more Jeep videos coming soon. And as you guys know, I just got monetized. I reached 1,000 views and I'm excited. And I thank you guys so much for that. Like you have no idea how much I appreciate it. And I can't wait to see where YouTube takes me. And if it can turn into a career someday, that'd be amazing. I would obviously love doing videos for you guys constantly if I if I was able to make the amount of money I'd need to survive too on the side, obviously. Like I'm not gonna just 
put it all into YouTube if I if I quit my job to do YouTube. I need some money to live. But anyways, hope you guys have a great day. Stay positive and hope you guys are enjoying my videos and let me know anything that'd be cool to add to the Jeeps. Either it's the Wrangler or my XJ. We want to uh, do a lot of work to them and make them look nice and make them ours. Like we, we're definitely getting uh, like full skid plates on the Wrangler and uh, rock sliders, bumpers, and then like the lift kit is going to come. Which is, is weird because the lifts are cheaper for those. Um, it must, there's just, I don't know what it is. It is cheaper. I thought it'd be more because it's a newer vehicle. But anyways, guys, have a great day. Stay positive and uh, leave some feedback in the comments. And I'll reply to every single one of them. See ya.